The growth of chain car washes in the metro has increased competition for the hands-on spray operations. So the owners of a car wash in Bellevue say they can't afford to have thieves target their family business. Mike McKnight shows us video of thefts as Six on Your Side investigates a possible repeat offender. A van backs up to a coin vacuum with what turns out to be two people inside and a dog riding shotgun. The intent appears to be breaking into the change holder, but the thieves pull off a damaging and expensive theft, likely just to steal quarters. They're taking the whole machine, I believe, just to get into this, and they're going to need more time, so they take it home and pry it open somehow. The suspects turn around so one thief can pick up the vacuum, though he struggles to get it in the back of the van. The theft happened about 10 o'clock at night with cars passing on busy Fort Crook Road. So after taking off this lock, this is what the thieves are after, quarters. But to get to these, they caused at least $3,000 in damage. That's just tearing out a vacuum, not to mention the cost of replacing the base. This is the third coin vacuum stolen in about a month from squeaky clean car wash and the mounting losses don't make them nickel and dime thefts. The replacement costs estimated at more than $9,000. That's a lot of money. We're not using insurance for this, so it's out of our pockets. There's no plan uh, to get them replaced. Fortunately, we have eight vacuums still here. Though the car wash is a full-time job for Sal, the family man can't be here around the clock, so he's relying on security cameras and alert neighbors. What do you do? You just, you just keep an eye out, keep yeah. an ear open. Call the cops. Buying the car wash about two years ago, the couple thought they had secured their investment. Well, we have these safety mechanisms to protect the quarters, but we never anticipate someone would just take the whole machine, let alone three of them. While the vacuum thefts and damage suck profits from their car wash income, we'll have to find a different way to secure it. The Holgans won't give up on their dreams of owning a small business, so they're hopeful the security camera video provides police with enough dirt on the suspects to make arrests. They are stealing our livelihood when they steal these vacuums. This is how one of the ways that we generate the money here. On your side along Fort Quirk Road near Chandler in Bellevue, Mike McKnight, 6 News. The car wash owners suspect the thieves steal the coins and then sell the damaged vacuums as scrap metal. Video of another theft showed a pickup, so there may be others involved. If anyone has any information on these thefts, call Bellevue Police or Sarpy County Crime Stoppers. There may be a reward in it for you. The mother of